Hey guys and welcome to a new video on this channel. I'm Sabi from Code Revolution. So in this morning I saw this message in my AdSense dashboard. So we encourage you to publish your seller information in the Google Sellers JSON file. Visit the account setting page to review your current visibility status. So this is a new message that keeps up popping right now in AdSense dashboards and it encourages you to add the uh, sellers.json file information to your AdSense account to combat fraud. So this is a little file that is added to your AdSense account and uh, using this file advertisers can get more information about you. So this is a help file that you can read regarding the sellers.json file. I will link it in this video's description for more info. So it states that this little file is a new standard that increases transparency in the ads ecosystem and helps combat fraud. So yeah, it's a pretty cool little thing to have and you can add this to your account by simply clicking on actions or if you see this through the bell icon on action here and it will be uh, you will go here in the account information settings and here you will need to click on transparent here so after you click on transparent you practically updated your um, sellers.json information and made it public. Now we can add also our domain. So in this case, it is coderevolution.ru. And when you click away, things are automatically saved. So no need to search for a save or apply button because uh, settings will be changed simply when you click away from the input field or so when you change the radio button here then it will be automatically saved okay so yeah this is all about the salary information visibility in the json file so here you will have some additional information about you and your uh, adsense account like seller id is confidential uh, which is set to false if you set here the transparent uh, box your name and your domain which you enter here note that the domain should be only the domain name and top level domain so it should not contain anything like https or slashes w w w and uh, similar things and also there are unsupported domain suffixes the top level domains these are unsupported right now only dot com and uh, dot uh, the country top level domains are supported and dot net so there are some limitations here okay so yeah and basically this is it after you done this you are uh, set up and ready for uh, accepting advertisers who check your sellers.json file so yeah this is all for today i hope this video helped until next time don't forget to subscribe to this channel and get more uh, similar videos because i release a new video each day at 7 pm gmt so thank you for watching until then have a nice day stay safe bye bye